All right, what's going on, everybody? I'm going to do a part two to get in, get it done, and get it over. Uh, and this is going to be talking about your health and, and your eating. Uh, I, I was just thinking about uh, this little grocery store, just thinking about, man, you know, my diet has really changed. A lot of stuff that I used to eat, I don't eat no more. Uh, I'm almost down to like zero uh, sweets, uh, definitely no sodas, not even sweet tea, nothing I have to put sugar in. Uh, and anyone who knows me knows that when I used to eat cereal, it had to have sugar in the cereal. Actually, I put cereal in the sugar. That's how bad it was. Um, but, you know, I, I was talking to a young man yesterday uh, in his 40s, and he was talking about his digestive system. Uh, some of the people that I know personally, uh, they have real bad digestive systems. That they're in their uh, 40s. And the thing that's amazing is a lot of times we don't understand that the food that we're eating and some of the diets that we're doing do not really match our DNA, do not match where we're from originally, do, do, do not match uh, what the body is uh, yearning for and, and craving for. Uh, for me, for some reason, I'm just real big on a lot of fruit here lately and some vegetables. I mean, that could be my meal all day long. Uh, and then, of course, I got to get my protein in. So uh, I do do a, a little powder protein shake from Advocare, which I'll be promoting some of these things uh, and showing you some of these products that I use. Uh, they don't sponsor me. Uh, I ain't got a check from them yet. I might need to start getting one <laughs> if uh, things are really popping off well. Uh, but, yeah, uh, I find myself also from a protein. I eat chicken. Of course, that's one of the things that most people that's into working out and weightlifting and bodybuilding or not. Uh, protein, they get the protein from chicken. You can also get it from fish certain types of fish, not all fish, but certain types of fish will give you some good protein uh, up from. And then, of course, uh, plant-based protein, which is really big now. A lot of people are getting the uh, protein for plants, but it's not every plant. Uh, it's not from every uh, vegetable, every fruit. Uh, there's some of these things that we don't even grow here in the United States. They're from other places, other countries uh, that the people have learned to be able to really have a good diet and digestive system. They have to be able to have this protein. One of the things I would say Suggest to you there's two things there's the IOC teas that I, that I drink uh, don't get paid from them either uh, we are distributors from them but we haven't really really pushed the product big to be able to uh, uh, get residual income off of it but the tea does work I, I will tell you this when I don't take the tea I can tell the difference and I've never had digestive system using restroom never had a problem with bowel movements uh, but this just really helps uh, really cleanse the body keeps it clean I drink it on a daily basis along with lemon water lemon water not just squeezing the lemon off inside of the water but also taking the hull and putting it off inside of the water uh, taking out some of the pulp and putting it inside of the water even going for so far to boiling the lemon uh, so that the skin can release its different nutrients off into the water and then you'll pull that also off into uh, your jug and drink it daily that's going to be a natural weight loss. It will attack the stomach. A lot of my weight loss and in inches of my stomach has come from uh, the drinking the lemon water. And then you must get you some probiotics, some healthy probiotics. You can get that from any Walmart. Ask the pharmacist. It's, it's not a prescription. It's over the counter. Um, I think it's called Healthy Choice, if I'm not mistaken. Uh, probiotics. And it's you take three of those a day, and they really, really help uh, keep the body cleansed. Uh, purifies it, cleans it out. Uh, uh, some stuff, listen, some stuff that be, you know, uh, not trying to be graphic, but some stuff that be in your stool, you be like, wow, I didn't know all that was up into me. So doing those things will help uh, purify your body, cleanse your body. That's why my skin looks not, I, I don't look 50. I put it like that. Uh, but uh, so my skin is tight. I don't have wrinkles, whatnot, because when you're cleansing your body while there's poisonous in it, uh, it, uh, it also affects your hair. It affects your uh, face. It affects your tone. It affects your color. It affects everything about you. So uh, really be serious and committed about your body. Really be serious and committed. Listen, some of these uh, food uh, diets and some of these uh, different ways of us eating, is we're going to have to adapt our body to it. Uh, do I want a little ice cream every now and then? Yes, but I know that it's not good for me. Do I do I want to be able to get some cake every now and then? Now, I will tell you, uh, I don't eat cake. I'm a pie man, but we got a guy at our job that this joker, you know, y'all might be looking at some big things. I might really drop some thousands of dollars to, to boost this guy and get his business out there. So when I tell you this man fixed some cakes, and we even came up with some creative cakes. Uh, some of y'all ain't never heard of it, but it's a sweet potato pound cake. Uh, we, uh, we even did another one the other day called a uh, uh, 
uh, what do you call that? Banana pudding pound cake. It was, oh my God. So, but I get a very, 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 very small scissor. I don't even get a slice. I get a, like a fourth of a slice. And really, you can almost read read through it. Uh, but just to get a taste of it. But I'm even getting away from, I told myself, man, I, I got to get away from that. I got to go total, no sugar at all in my body. Till I get down to my prime weight. And every now and then, it's good to be able to cheat and, and have you a slice of this and a slice of that. Uh, some of y'all, you, you can't eat beef. You can't eat pork. Um, you know, even some of y'all, you can't even eat chicken. Uh, your body's just really telling you what it is that it wants and you have to by all means necessary uh, give the body exactly what it is craving for one person's diet is not always another person's diet uh, you know even with some of the diets that's out the keto diet the keto diet ain't for everybody it is for a big group of people but for some people it just ain't for everybody uh, some of you need to have carbs some of you need to have certain things in your body that other people are saying that they're denying the body from listen uh, find out what works for you. Get involved in your diet of eating. Okay. Then whatever you got to do, get in, get it done, and then get it over with. Once you get used to eating this food and it becomes first nature to your system and your digestive system, whatnot, listen, it, you, you'll be craving it. You'll be wanting it. I, it's amazing how much fruit that I pile up at my house and I eat. I'm talking about live fruit, stuff like uh, 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 I try to make sure I do blueberries. I try to make sure I do blackberries. Uh, I do pineapple, fresh cut pineapple. Um, also do watermelon because it's mainly just water. Uh, but it, all this has its own natural sugars, own natural sweetening to it. Uh, but I eat it in moderation. I don't do grapes unless they have seeds in it. Learn how to eat. And I don't do watermelon unless it has seeds in it. Learn how to eat fruit that have seed in it. Fruits that do not have a seed in it is genetically manufactured and is not good for your body, period. I don't care what people say. I don't care how good it tastes and the convenience that you ain't got to spit out the seeds. Listen, be inconvenient. If you're going to eat it, be inconvenient and eating it the right way to get out of it what you need to get because uh, the other kind of grapes that's, that's out there that have no seed in it, uh, other fruits that have no seed in it, it, it's, it's, it has a lot of sugar. It has a lot of other stuff in it that is because it's, it's not good for you. It's just it's, it's genetically made in the lab. It is just not healthy for your body. So I just want to kind of do a part two of get it in, get it done, and get it over with, dealing with your eating, dealing with your health. Uh, if you Let me tell you number one, one more thing and I, uh, as I leave here. I'm put up into another grocery store to buy some stuff. I figured this out. If I don't buy it, I can't eat it. I ain't the kind of guy that's getting up at 1 or 2 o'clock in the morning, running no 7-Eleven, getting no IC, and getting no candy, none of that. If I don't buy it, if it's in my house, and I wake up at 12 or 1, and I have a craving, and if that snacks ain't in there, and the chips ain't in there, I won't eat it. I ain't going to get in my car to go get, go get none of that. But So I try to make sure that whatever is in my house is something that I will eat, something that will be fulfilling to my body, something that's going to be beneficial for my body, bananas and stuff like that. So I buy stuff that I know if I wake up, in the middle of the night and I'm craving something. I'm not grabbing no chips. I'm not grabbing no popcorn. I'm grabbing something that's going to continue to aid to the uh, recovery and the health of my body and then the growth of what I'm trying to look for in certain areas of my life, my, my body and then just the lifestyle that I'm just trying to pertain. Listen, I'm 50 years old. I got every one of my teeth except for my wisdom. I had them out at 18, but all of my teeth, I have my teeth. I have no cavities. I have no feelings. These are all my natural white teeth. Thank God for Invisalign that they was able to straighten up a few of them that was kind of crooked. Didn't realize it was crooked. <laughs> Somebody has told me, but I got all that fixed. So, uh, but yeah, I, I, I floss, I uh, rinse, and I all with Listerine, old school Listerine, floss. Rinse with old school Listerine and just use your, your choice of toothpaste and do it two times a day. If you do that, you're going to have a healthy mouth. A healthy mouth shows a healthy system. So you need to be able to get these things active in your life. Uh, really take your health, take your body serious. It's nobody else's body but yours. Stop talking about this is just how I am and this is you know people have to love me for how I am. Listen, sometimes you don't even love you for how you are. Let's change that mindset. Let's change the system. If you change your thinking, you change the system of your body, change the system of your life, and then guess what? You're able to be loved by yourself, loved by others even greater because people will see you happy. Sometimes people don't want to be around us because they see how miserable we've made ourselves because of how we, we made ourselves to look. So be encouraged. Get it done. Get it. Get in. Get it done. And get it over with. And you'll see that you have a greater life to live. All right? God bless you. We love you. Oh.